Today we're looking at the matte black and timber Rubino and it looks awesome. Hey everyone, I'm Luke and welcome back to the Artistic YouTube channel where we guide you through all things coffee. And so you don't miss out one of our latest videos, make sure you do like and subscribe and hit the bell and you'll be notified when we put up our latest video. And if you've got a question today about the new Quick Mill Rubino matte black and timber, hey, leave it in the comments below. We love answering all the questions that you guys post towards us. And if you're watching us from the US, remember we do have our new merch site which has been launched. So get yourself some merch and make sure you do share some of those photos of all the awesome gear you get from there. Quick Mill coffee machines and grinders from Italy have been producing great stuff over recent years. You might be familiar with the stainless steel Rubino and we've done a review on that as well. They're really stepping up their game at the moment with things like the Sierra Matte Black Grind you see on the side here, which is available next year. We'll come back to that one. But today we're looking at the Rubino Matte Black and Timber that is available now. So it's definitely a trend now to customize your coffee machine at home. A lot of people look to either add timber or put some colors and things like that on some of the panels. But in this package, it's all been done for you. And it looks amazing. You've got the full matte black, which is in the cup rail, the top, the sides, and around the bottom drip tray. But they have left where you put your cups and the actual um, bottom drip tray where you're gonna be extracting coffee as stainless steel. Because we all know that when you do paint something, it can chip. So that's a really smart move. But when you look at it as a pack, it highlights the chrome big um, lever steam taps, the E61 brew head, uh, and the little details that they've got around the machine. Overall, it just fits amazing. The insides of the machine are the same as the normal Rubino with the 1.8 litre boiler, which is huge for this kind of price point. You've got the three litre tank, um, the same E61 brew head. You've got the gauge down the front there as well, which lets you know about how much steam pressure the machine actually has. You've got your standard on lights and your element lights as well. And it does buzz at you if you run out of water or remove the tank, which is the safety feature so it doesn't run out of water and basically wreck your element. So that's all the really cool stuff that most machines have, but these guys just do it that little bit nicer. Quick mill add a lot of extras when you buy a machine. You do get a timber 58 mil tamper, an extra single basket with the timber handle, group cleaning brush, blind basket, and there is a little USB card to give you access to a lot of extra information about the machine, how to make coffee, and that's awesome. When we look at the business end of the coffee machine, there's a lot of little things that are different to the normal Rubino. The first things you notice is the steam taps and the hot water taps are lever. So they're not the dial, you simply just press them down and that can lock on. You can go either way to give a little quick purge if you like, or up or down to lock them on. And that's a really nice lever action. And if you have a look a bit closer, you'll see that they haven't just used stainless steel here. I think they've used some sort of black metal not sure what it is, but that little bit of detail really does help tie in that black paintwork. That's a real nice touch. And the other awesome thing is both the hot tap and the steamer are cool touch. So you don't have to have the big rubber on there and essentially you can move that steam wand wherever you like without burning yourself. And you've got your double porter filter here, which is your 18 gram basket in your single there. It looks like the seven or nine grams. Um, that's a really nice smooth finish on that timber. It just feels nicely polished and really well machined. On your group lever for saturating your coffee, again, another nice little timber knob on there. That's finished beautifully. Um, and the one thing I do want to show you as you remove the drip tray, because you don't normally see this in a machine at this price point, it does have the full stainless steel chassis, which is great. Um, a lot of machines do get extra water in there um, and it can make that rust out but I'm so pleased that they've really kept that with this model. 
So the good thing about these machines is they're fully serviceable. The E61 head, the levers, the steam taps, all these parts are readily available across a whole range of machines that all come out of Italy. So they will last a long time and you can refurb them essentially down the track. Unlike other cheaper entry machines, which are a bit more uh, plastic build and probably have a, a disposable nature to them when they break. So the machine does have the three litre water tank with a vibration pump, so it is not plumbable to mains water. So we've got a 12 month warranty with the quick mill gear and that's from where you basically buy it from. And the price at the moment is 3,100. So that's a whole lot of value with all these customized extras at that price with a big boiler. There's not much out in the market there that's gonna compete with that. So that's enough about the specs, let's make a coffee. <laughs>